All right, uh, moving on to some F1 now as we wind down on the show this evening. McLaren F1 boss Zach Brown uh, has written a letter uh, to the governing body of Formula One, the FIA, in which he says Red Bull breaking the budget cap uh, constitutes cheating. In the letter, Brown calls for penalties that will hit Red Bull financially and also on the track. Brown adds the FIA should communicate subsequent action and penalties at pace to maintain the integrity of the sport. The letter uh, was sent today, Monday, to the team, uh, who in addition to McLaren have uh, not committed any cost cap offenses, Ferrari, Mercedes, Alpine, Alfa Romeo and Haas. The FIA announced last week that Red Bull were guilty of a minor breach of the cap, uh, the lesser of two categories of offense under F1's financial regulations. The budget cap was introduced last year and it has taken uh, until October this year for the FIA to release its findings because of the complexity of the process. Interesting one. Uh, I mean, something is really brewing over there in F1. Um, I, I know that there are a lot of people who are trying to find ways to use technicalities uh, to take away the Constructors' Championship from, um, from Red Bull. I don't think that's going to happen uh, when you consider the fact that you know, they've only exceeded the cap by, you know, just a few million dollars. Uh, but, I mean, who knows if the other teams, I mean, it could bring up to the point where the other teams, you know, absolutely revolt. And then it becomes a major, major issue. But there's always been talks uh, in the paddock uh, and, you know, conversations amongst journalists, among people close to these uh, teams as to how much money exactly are they spending. And are they sure uh, that they are keeping to the rules? Uh, and, I mean, FIA introduces the budget cap, and just, you know, the first time they are trying to uh, find out if people are breaking it or not, they find out that the world champions are actually guilty um, of breaking the gap.